So you guys probably heard in Sunday school about the widow's might, yes? yes? Do you remember what the point of that story was? That Yes? Does anybody, what, what was it about? About giving what you have? The widow? Okay, so what do I have here? Money. I do. Whoa, 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 whoa. Okay, nobody grab them, nobody grab them, nobody grab them. Okay, so I've got, I think these are 50 pennies because that's a roll of pennies. Now, wasn't that the lesson of the story? Now, say that all these pennies were mine. No. Right, all those pennies were mine. Now, if I had all those pennies and I gave two of those pennies to the Lord, I mean, that'd be okay, but would it be like a really like huge sacrifice? Because I got all these pennies left, right? Yes. But, well, now what if I gave maybe half my pennies to the Lord? That, that, uh, that, you have I would only have not as much left, huh? Have 20. I know, I'd only have 25, good job. I know. I know. So that's giving kind of a lot more, isn't it? Because two plus three is four. Is five. Very smart. You guys are doing some good math. So now, what would happen if I gave all of this and only kept two for myself? That, that's <gasps> going to be, that's going to be like, um. That's not going to be very much, is it? But think about all the good that all these pennies could do for other people. So that might be kind of a lot to give away. But you know what the story of the widow's might is? All she had, all she had were these two coins. And you know what she did? Do you know what she did with her two coins? She gave them up. She gave them to the Lord. But then the widow. Wow. The widow, the widow I know she, well, the widow didn't, I know she didn't have all of this, but you know what? We're so blessed that probably most of us have at least 50 pennies, right? Probably, probably. So what we hear in the widow's might and what we hear in our, all of our scripture readings for today, they're all about generosity. I'm rich. And you, you are. <laughs> well, we, you are rich in more ways than you might know because I it's... I got two piggy bits. I know. So I got one piggy bank. I know. So what do you think you guys could do with some of that money that's in your piggy bank? You could save, that's or true. Give or give it away. That is the lesson. I don't, I don't yeah. Well, that's okay. I bet you're, from your mommy or daddy, you could have some pennies and you could give those away. So the point of these stories is, is it better to keep it all to ourselves? No. No. What's it better to do? Give some of it away as much as we can. Like how I always say in, in tithing, if you feel called and able to do so, you give what you can. And that's what we're going to hear about. But let's put them all back so everybody can get. So put them all back. Let's put them all back, sweetheart. <laughs> put them all back. There we go. We'll put them all back. So let's see. How many of you are up here? Two, four, six, eight. Okay. So how about everybody take four each? Four each, four each. Make sure everybody gets four each. I got five. Oh, four each. And I then four. guess what you guys can decide to do with your four? Did you get your four, sweetheart? Make sure four each. I got four. Did everybody get four? Okay, now guess what? Five. That's my gift to you, and you guys can decide. I got six. You can keep those to yourself. Here, everybody can have, yeah. Everybody got some? You can keep those to yourself. Or you can give them to maybe a friend who looks sad and need encouragement. Or you could give them to somebody who you see in need. Or you could put them in the offering box. But that's a free gift to you. And now you guys can decide what you're going to do with your pennies. Remembering that Jesus said, I yeah, I know. It is more blessed to give than receive. Okay, so let's pray. Lord God, we're so grateful for all the good gifts that you give to us. And for your call to share the love that you give us and the resources that you give us and the life that you give us with others. And we give you thanks for all your good gifts and this season of sharing. And all this we pray in Jesus' name. Amen. Amen.